Hello, welcome to how to solve this very nice algebra equation x minus 1 over 2 whole cubed minus x minus 1 over 2 whole squared plus x is equal to 105 over 2. We need to find all possible values of x. So, let's start. x minus 1 over 2 whole cubed minus x minus 1 over 2 whole squared plus uh, x is equal to this uh, 105 can be written as uh, 104 plus 1 divided by 2. Next x minus 1 over 2 whole cubed minus x minus 1 over 2 whole squared plus uh, x is equal to this uh, 104 plus uh, 1 over 2 can be written as uh, 104 over 2 plus uh, 1 over 2. Next x minus uh, 1 over 2 whole cubed minus x minus 1 over 2 whole squared plus uh, x. We move this uh, 1 over 2 to the left hand side, it will become negative 1 over 2 is equal to this uh, 104 divided by 2 is 52. Now, here we have x minus 1 over 2, here we have x minus 1 over 2 and here we have x minus 1 over 2. So, we suppose that uh, let x minus 1 over 2 is equal to m. Then, uh, this equation will become m cubed minus m squared plus uh, m is equal to 52. Now, we move this uh, 52 to the left hand side, then this will become m cubed minus uh, m squared plus uh, m minus 52 is equal to 0. Next, m cubed minus m squared plus uh, m. We can write this uh, negative 52 as, uh, we can write this negative 52 as negative 64 plus uh, 16 minus 4. So, this will become negative 64 plus uh, 16 minus 4 is equal to 0. Now, this is 64, 64 is same as 4 cube. So, we write this 64 with this m cubed. And this is 16, 16 is same as 4 squared. So, we write this 16 with this m squared. And we write this uh, negative 4 with this m. So, this will become m cubed minus 64 minus m squared plus uh, 16 plus m minus 4 is equal to 0. Next, m cubed minus 64. If we take a negative sign outside the brackets, then this uh, negative m squared will become positive m squared and this uh, plus 16 will become negative 16 plus uh, m minus 4 is equal to 0. Next, m cubed minus this is 64 can be written as 4 cubed minus m squared minus this 16 can be written as 4 squared. From these two terms we can factor out plus 1. In bracket left m minus 4 is equal to 0. Now, by using this uh, algebraic identity a cubed minus b cubed is equal to a minus b times a squared plus uh, a b plus 
v squared. This m cubed minus 4 cubed will become m minus 4 times m squared plus 4 times m plus 4 squared or 16 minus by using this algebraic identity a squared minus b squared is equal to a plus b times a minus b. This m squared minus 4 squared will become m plus 4 times m minus 4 plus 1 time m minus 4 is equal to 0. Now, as you can see this expression m minus 4, this expression m minus 4, this expression m minus 4 is a common system. So, we factor out this m minus 4 and in bracket left, in bracket left this m squared plus 4m plus 16 minus m plus 4 and plus 1. In bracket left m squared plus 4 times m plus 16 minus this m and due to this minus this positive 4 will become negative 4 plus 1 is equal to 0. Next m minus 4 times m squared this 4m minus 1m will become plus 3m. 16 minus 4 12, 12 plus 1 plus 13 is equal to 0. From here either this expression m minus 4 is equal to 0 or this expression m squared plus 3 times m plus 13 is equal to 0. From this equation we get the value of m is equal to 4. From this quadratic equation we have a is equal to 1, b is equal to 3 and c is equal to 13. According to quadratic formula m is equal to negative 3 plus minus square root of place of b squared we write 3 squared minus 4 times in place of a we write 1 times in place of c we write 13 divided by 2 times in place of a we write 1 next m is equal to negative 3 plus minus square root of this 3 squared is 9 minus 4 times 1 times 13 52 divided by 2 times 1, 2. Next, m is equal to negative 3 plus minus square root of this 9 minus 52 is negative 43 divided by 2. m is equal to negative 3 plus minus this uh, square root of negative 43 can be written as uh, square root of 43 times square root of negative 1 divided by 2. Next, m is equal to negative 3 plus minus uh, square root of 43. This uh, square root of negative 1 will become i divided by 2. In the first uh, we found the value of m is equal to 4. Now to find the values of x uh, recall that we have supposed we have supposed that uh, x minus 1 over 2 is equal to m. We have supposed that uh, x minus 1 over 2 is equal to m. So, when m is equal to 4, then this equation will become x minus 1 over 2 is equal to 4.
4 we move this uh, negative 1 over 2 to the right hand side then this will become x is equal to 4 plus uh, 1 over 2 next x is equal to we can write the denominator of this 4 1 and we take LCM of this 1 and this 2 LCM of 1 and 2 is 2 and 2 divided by 1 2 2 times this 4 8 plus 2 divided by 2 1 and 1 time this 1 1. So, from here we get the value of x is equal to 9 over 2. This is the first value of x is this is the first solution of this equation. Now, when m is equal to this expression then this will become x minus 1 over 2 is equal to negative 3 plus minus uh, root 43i divided by 2. Now, we move this uh, negative 1 over 2 to the right hand side then this will become x is equal to negative 3 plus minus uh, root 43i divided by 2 plus 1 over 2. Next, x is equal to, we can write the common denominator 2. In this expression will come here negative 3 plus minus root 43i, this plus and this one will come here. Next, x is equal to negative 3 plus 1 is uh, negative 2 plus minus uh, root 43i divided by 2. This is the second and third value of x. So, we have three solutions of uh, this equation.